Go. Sailors from Fleet Activities Sasebo held a ribbon cutting ceremony at the new landing craft air cushion facility in Yokose. This facility is, no kidding, a world class facility. And this facility, along with the new maintenance shops, all the tools and everything, allows us um, a much more flexible, much more operationally ready uh, command and, and allows us to push the LCAX out much faster. This new LCAC facility is part of the U.S. Navy's ongoing partnership with Japan. The United States Navy, the United States Army, the government of Japan, and many, many others have invested enormously. Uh, and again, this truly uh, uh, one-of-a-kind, world-class facility that uh, we are very humbly uh, and uh, graciously honored and privileged to operate. One of the positive benefits of this facility is that it makes operations quieter for the surrounding community. The uh, hush houses are truly unique. Uh, they're the only two like it in the world. When we put an LCAC inside and close the doors, we can spin up the engines and you and I can have a conversation outside without raising our voices. For the sailors, moving all of their equipment to Yokose was a long task. The process is tedious. There's a lot of work that went into it. Getting your stuff together, taking what you need. All in all, we got all our stuff over here. It's all secure, it's all working, it's all that matters. And those sailors are now ready to take over operations at the new facility. The real important message, though, I think, is that it's operated and maintained by the finest uh, men and women in the world, the sailors of the United States Navy. And now that they're settled into their new facility, these sailors are ready to take LCAC operations in the Pacific Fleet to another level. Seaman Andrew Frisbee, Fleet Activities, Sasebo, Japan.